Oh, hey guys. No, I'm not standing on a bass boat this morning, but I'm headed fishing. I'm not standing on a bay boat, but I'm headed fishing. I'm not on a cruise ship, which doesn't make any sense. But me and these guys are out in the country this morning. Fixing to do a little gate hopping, fixing to do a little fence hopping. It slipped down to the creek. Go catch some smallmouth bass. Are you boys ready? Yes. Okay. Is it cold for June? Yes. Does that matter? No. Here we go. One more gate. This is the last gate. The last gate. And when we get over this gate, you coming? Yeah. We can step through this one. Beautiful down here, man. Being little, you just go right under, huh? We're in the sticks, baby. We love Tennessee, don't we, boys? Mm -hmm. Love Tennessee. Tennessee in us? Oh, Hudson. Hudson's going to get chiggers and snakes on him routine. What was that? So, Hudson says, one of the reasons, the only reason he doesn't like the creek is snakes, right? Or what, what is the deal with snakes? Tell us. If you mark their territory, then he, um, he will bite you. If you mark their territory. Okay, can you explain to us what marking their territory means? It means if you go five feet or more um, to it. Five feet or more to it, you get bit by a snake. This is, uh, what do you think about this rider advice? Uh, I don't think it's true. <laughs> okay, we'll find out. Tell a little, uh... Here we go, boys. It's been a while since we've been here. I forgot where the uh, pathway was. It is beautiful. Just like Avatar? got to take care of the fish, catch and release the smallmouth, you got to, it's just, I'm anxious to see how it fishes because I used to fish it a lot when I was a kid, I don't get to do it anymore, it's been a while, but let's see if we can catch some today, they see a lot of baits, a lot of live bait, unfortunately, no, they're all live bait, but a lot of the Folks, I know it's kind of a cop out. They just cast net up some minnows and the smallmouth can't resist them. So, try our... you missed him. Yeah. Oh, we'll get into some current. Get him, get him, baby. <laughs> right there, riders on. Don't reel him all the way up to the end. Don't reel him all the way up to the end, bud. Give him some line. I saw that fish too over there. Alright, swing him up here. On the board. I saw that fish over there too. Like dad. Large mouth. Is this a tournament? Yeah. Hey dad, will you will you grab the rod for me? Here. That's why you want to give yourself more line. You don't always you want to reel him up to the dad, end. Dad, gum. Show him to the camera. A little salmon. A little salmon, it's a large mouth. Good job. On the Ned Rig. Got him. Oh, it's a nice one, too. Oh, it's a nice one. Oh, yeah. Nice one. Oh, he came off. No. Oh, that was a good one. Be quiet. Dang it, man.
Oh, he does. Yeah, baby. Yeah, Dude, Ryder. Great job. Oh, Great job. Oh, it's a black perch. It's a rock bass. He's showing, showing to me. He gets you? Oh, he got you. Those fins on his back are, are a booger. Yeah, they're kind of spiky like a pinfish. Here, pick him up. There you go. There you go. Good job, man. He's pretty. Let me take him. Yeah, get the hook out of him. Okay. Oh, Ned Rig. I want Ned Rig. Holy crap. You want a picture of him? Yeah. This is crazy. He's so beautiful. Got him. I think it's a large man. Ooh. Yeah, baby. Dude, I thought it was Shh, quit screaming. I know you're excited. Oh, he came off. Jeez. Jeez. Got several bites right here. <laughs> Got him, baby. All right. Black perch, finally. You're throwing right where I'm throwing every single time. Right there. Little Ned Rig, look at this guy. Fun right there. There you go. Hudson's got him a black perch. Oh, I'm throwing right at the edge of the current. Like right there. So these fish in this current got this raging river, hard current. Good job, bud. And it'll make an edge right here. It's a current seam. And trout, you know, if you're trout fishing, if you're spotted bass fishing in a river, if you're smallmouth bass, largemouth bass, whatever, below dams. See, if I throw my bait out like this, it just look, it's just gone. Of course, those big smallmouth will, they'll hold right in it. But a lot of times they get right on the edge so they can ambush stuff. And like these other fish, like those rock bass that we're catching, black perch we call them, goggle eyes some people call them. They're going to sit right on the edge, large mouth want to be right on the edge, but a seam, and you have to really look for it with your eyes. A little current seam. Jumped off. Jeez. I'm not getting a hook in them. Can you even see it? Oh, that's a good one there. Hey, watch out, Ryder. Ryder, you might want to watch out. It's running up in the grass. Well, it's not a, it's, it's a small mouth. I just, we're all tangled up. It's a large mouth. It, it jumped over your line. Nice large mouth, baby. Yo, get off my leg, boy. 
Get off Ryder's legs, boy. I'll grab him. Yeah, I got him. Here, bud. I got it. Cute as a dang button right there. Look at that. That's a nice large mouth for the creek. Yeah. I need to get that. Yeah. There we go. What is he night rider? Nice and Hudson. Hey, you want to hold him? I'll get your thing. Can I him back? Yeah, he's him back. Just ease him back right there. Here. I'm hearing a current. Hey, Dad, I'll stay in this water. I'm good. Yeah, he went and hit under that rock. Hey, goofball. Your head's under a rock. Where is he? He's right there. Can I see him? Wait, really? But I can catch him in my bare hands. See you. Oh but God, you can't. <laughs> I pushed him under the rock. He slid on the rock. No, I pushed him. Hey. There we go. That one's mine. Look, look, there's another one. There's another one. Nice. There you go. There's one on the bed right here. Dad, Another one with it. Here, hold him. Here, let me have a rod. That one right there got excited. Come here, Hudson. Dad, he's got to go. <laughs> Alright. There you go, buddy. See, bud. That wraps up the creek trip. Just got back to the truck after the long walk. Ryder's tired. Hudson's tired. Hudson's tired from catching more fish than us. He caught a lot more fish than us. Uh, awesome trip, other than one weird uh, incident with a camper that still we didn't really get to go where we wanted to go. It was kind of kind of strange. All right, so. Our trip's getting cut a little short because we're wading up through here and we kind of came up on some interesting characters. That's what I'll say. On the creek bank and they didn't act like they wanted us here. Of course, we're in the water. We're not trespassing or anything like that, but no more than they are. But uh, we got some interesting looks and because I got these two guys and I care about their safety, and don't want to put them in a weird spot. We're uh, sneaking out of here. So, creek trip ended. An encounter, to say the least. Turned the camera off for that one. But uh, we're out of here. Still not sure what was going on there. But uh, that and one big largemouth we found on the bed that wouldn't bite. Middle of June. Found a large mouth on the bed in the creek, and it was just so weird, but it, she wouldn't swim off. She just wouldn't bite. It's on a bed. A little boner. Caught more large mouth than we did small mouth. Only landed one small mouth. I lost a nice one. Ryder caught a, caught a small one, and I jumped off another nice one, so... I don't know. It was uh, it was an interesting day. It always is in the creek. You never know what's going to happen. But if you got a creek close to you, drop some comments below on your favorite techniques. Thanks for subscribing, liking, commenting, all that good stuff. Hudson, anything you want to say in closing? Mm -hmm. Didn't think so. See ya!